Here we go, your opening night lineup for the 2019-2020 Worcester Rattlers, presented by Polar Beverages. On defense, number three, Justin Murray. On defense, number five, Kyle McKenzie. Here comes J.D. Dudek for the Railers. Across center, near side. He's upended in the face by Summers, but no call. And there's the call on the ice. Four minutes gone by here in the first period. Scoreless hockey game between the Thunder and the Railers. Samuels Thomas finds Tanner Pond. Top of the left circle. Riffs went along. Loose in front. They score. Jordan Samuels Thomas puts it home for the Railers, who take a 1-0 lead. Cam, I know we're only 4-10 into this hockey game, but already a much different feel early on for the Railers offensively. Great looks on the power play. Gerard will turn that one over, and now Connor Doherty with the A on his sweater back for his third season with the Railers. I like the A on Tots' sweater. It looks good on that orange jersey as well. As Brower back in the offensive end for the Railers. Over to Thomas, fires and scores! Kyle Thomas gives the Railers a 2-0 lead with 12.03 left in the first period. Uh, we mentioned Jamie Russell did some work in this offseason, and two of the players that he brought in, uh, Cam, here in the first period have already scored. JST up the first, and Kyle Thomas. Back up to the point to Dudek. Dudek will swing with Almeida. Below the left dot, Pirac Chrysais. Almeida fires and scores! Oh, captain, my captain, Barry Almeida. It's a power play goal, and the Railers lead 3-0 with 826 left in the first period. Boy, the Railers making it look easy here in the first. Their third goal. Hayden Verbeek gets across the blue line at the left dot. A lot of speed to the high slot. No one there. Now picked up by Piero Zabatel. Glove saved by Skarik, who left the rebound for the entry to nod, and what a play by Drew Kaladu. And the Thunder back to full strength. Oh, Pons got a heavy shot. Shukarov back at the point. We have our first fight of the evening. It's Kyle Thomas as he takes down Blake Thompson below the right circle. And hey, Kyle Thomas with the fight for the Railers. Jacob Skarik just three shots in the first period face here's Matt Schmalz fires McNiven makes a save rebound they score <laughs> Ryan Hitchcock just 19 seconds into the second period Railers four Adirondack zero do we see Amy McAdam now that shot by Schmalz almost stuck through it's near side here Walker tried to find Payne on the far side post broken up by Jordy Walker out to Payne, all alone, high slot, back in. What a save from Jacob Skarik, who gobbles it up on the paddle. Robbie Payne and the whole net to shoot at. Up to Almeida, but Almeida coughs it up in the neutral zone, and it's picked up by Sissons. That pass was behind Azarian. Big, Big hit, hit from Mike Cornell. And look, on Felix Gerard. Stick by Chukarov. As Thomas looking for JST with the stretch pass. JST, nifty move below the right circle. Fires loose in front, and Murray was there to slam on the rebound, but just got tied up with a stick. Who leaves it for Waken? Back to Sissons. Rister, and they sealed away by Skerrick as Gerard was on top of the crease. And the power play will expire for the Thunder. Dropping it over four. And a break here, two on one. JST, right circle. Slams on the brakes, waiting, waiting, fires and goes just wide and up into the netting, showing some patience there for the big man. Shots in favor of Worcester right now, 21-15. As it's turned over, here's Gerard, centers it in front to Walker and Adirondack scores as Ryan Walker on the near side post will strike and Adirondack finally gets on the board. Cross ice to Sedeo, but out of his reach. And scoop backed up by the Railers. Here comes Samuels Thomas over to Thomas, over to Dudek. Dudek fires and scores! J.D. Dudek, his first professional goal, comes in the third period against Worcester. A 5-1 lead with 14.38 left in the final period. I think that goal's going to give Thomas the Gordie Howe hat trick. And Thomas sure got the better end of Thompson. 
Here goes J.D. Dudek trying to make it a two-goal night. It went and up both posts. It looks like it hit off both posts, as you said, Eric. And then McNiven falls right on his back. Wow. Somehow kept it out of the net. Railers quickly counter the other way. As JST will roll this one in on net. Smalls with the rebound chance. Oh. McNiven, an acrobatic save. Like Schmalz has had quite a few chances tonight. Going to be three straight home opener wins for the Worcester Railers. As the Railers come out on top, a 5-1 win over Adirondack. 1-0 to start the season. Now the boys off the bench saluting a netminder kick of Skarik. Win number one for he. Big crowd. Five goals, a good scrap. Everyone's gonna leave home happy here tonight, Cam McGuire.